Another aspect to kind of getting started right has to do with organization. And this is probably the least sexy of the, all the topics, but at the end of the day, it's probably going to save you most time. Okay, so here is my file structure on my computer. I keep a media library where I have all my audio tracks and my e-learning brothers templates and assets and resources, fonts, graphics, sound effects, video clips. These are things that I use repetitively. Okay, so I keep all that stuff in their own folder. But when I create a video project, let me give you just an example. In fact, on my face, one of my Facebook groups today, somebody posted a picture. This is what someone asked a question, how do you organize your content for your videos? And this particular person, this is what their organization looks like. Okay? Everything stored on their desktop. And if this looks like the way you are working on your videos, I'm going to suggest that you're kind of setting yourself up for a little bit of frustration. Right? So clearly, keeping a directory structure organized is kind of the way to go. You'll find, and I'll kind of open up a bad example here, uh, that when you mix all this stuff together, all of your audio narration files, and here I have my script and my storyboard and my screen recordings and video clips and all this stuff, if you just kind of jumble it all together, then you'll find yourself hunting and pecking and wondering where stuff is. So let me give you a quick suggestion here. I have what I call a master project directory. Okay, and this is just what I organize my projects as. Right, so I'll kind of leave this just for a second, but in essence, all my audio narration and audio stuff goes in one folder all my documents, my scripts, and stuff like that, the graphics that are specific to the project. When I produce out of Camtasia, I put them all in a folder, uh, my project file. So you can see I kind of have a directory structure, and here's kind of the secret sauce. Whenever I start a new project, watch what I do. Let me just back that up. All of these are basically just empty folders. This is a placeholder. It's a master. So watch what I do. I just right click on this and say copy. I then can go into where I store my projects, a folder, and then right click and paste. And then all I have to do is rename this to my new project. My new project. There we go. And when I open it up, a whole directory structure that is consistent, that I use every time. All my recordings are always here. All my video clips are always here. And that's where I start to put the things for my new project, okay? So hopefully that's a couple of uh, quick little things that are going to help folks out.